Thank you for investing your time to learn more about our Bite Size Azure series. My name is Jason Lambert, Cloud Technical Consultant for Microsoft Azure here at Ingram Micro. And today, I'd like to talk with you about Microsoft Azure Backup. A really cool turnkey technology in the Microsoft Cloud portfolio. What's really neat is if you look at other competitors in the industry, usually they have in the infrastructure arena, they have a target where you would need to find a third party solution to create the backup strategy and use that infrastructure providers target or storage in Microsoft Microsoft owns the entire stack so Microsoft deploys the software and updates and manages the software technology as well as the target and entitles you to back up not only on premises machines but virtual machines as well if you're an organization where, or a partner rather where you have customers in the enterprise arena Microsoft Azure backup will integrate very well with Microsoft System Center. This presentation isn't going to go over the integration of System Center, but we'll go over uh, the ability to use Microsoft Azure Backup in the SMB arena. So to get started, uh, first step would be to go to us.cloud.im. That would be where you would create your customer's Azure tenant. I'm not going to go through that process here, but if you look up on the screen uh, you'll be able to go through the menu at the top here and um, find another video that I did on creating a tenant in Cloud Marketplace. That will get you to uh, portal.azure.com. Once you get the credentials again you're going to log into portal.azure.com and start configuring your backup solution for your customer. You'll be able to download and install that uh, Mars client on your Windows server. Again it'd be Windows Server 2008 through 2016 and that will back up your data securely uh, to the Azure cloud. You also have the ability to uh, restore to either uh, the same or dissimilar hardware uh, through the service as well. If by chance you have databases, so we're talking about SQL, SharePoint, Exchange, or Active Directory, you wouldn't necessarily follow the process that I just told you, but you would go through portal.azure.com, specify that you have databases that you want to back up. You will have to supply your own Windows Server as well as a server license and storage and then you can download and install Azure Backup Server on that backup server uh, infrastructure that you have and be able to back up those databases. I believe you get a five day local retention uh, to back up those databases and then Microsoft Azure Backup Server will offload them to the cloud as well. Um, only limitation with this service is it does not give you the ability to spin up a virtual machine locally. If you want to do virtual machine spin up or uh, replication or DR type strategy, you want to look at the video up above uh, in the stack where I talk about Azure Site Recovery. Microsoft Azure Backup actually encrypts your data on premises in transit through to the data center through SSL and then it also is encrypted at rest in AES SSL encryption up in Microsoft Azure. One thing that you must know is that you own the key to your backup. When you create that key in your tenant it's your key. If you lose access to your key you lose access to your data. Microsoft does not have the ability to recover your key and get access to your data if in the instance that the, the key is lost. Microsoft also offers geo-replication. So by default, when you create your account and you start doing backup, you have locally redundant storage. Locally redundant storage on Azure is one region, has three data centers, so three data centers the size of a super Walmart store, and your data by default is replicated amongst those three data centers. If you decide to use geo-replication, Microsoft Azure will replicate your data against two regions. Both regions have three data centers the size of super Walmart stores, and your data will re be replicated six times. The regions must be a minimum of 400 miles apart. So for example, if you're in the US East, you will replicate against US West and vice versa. If you're in South Central, uh, you'll replicate against North Central and vice versa. 
In summary, Azure Backup is a really great technology. It's a tool that you can deploy through the Microsoft Azure solution at portal.azure.com for your customers' needs. Also, I just want to bring to mind, if you decide that you have a business based on Veeam or Acronis or any of the other third-party solutions out there, you can use Microsoft Data Center or Storage to use those backup solutions uh, to back up to Azure as well. Recognize that Microsoft Azure Backup is a tool. We would love for you to use that tool, but the strategy that you use to back up your customer's infrastructure is completely yours. And so the tools are yours to, uh, to be used at your disposal. Thank you for investing your time to learn more about our Bite Size Azure series. There's a menu here at the top left corner of your screen where you can drop down and uh, find more information about the, the series and the different presentations that we have, or you're welcome to go to ingramicrocloud.com forward slash Microsoft to learn more.